Hello, this is Brian Atkinson from Computer Role Management. Uh, we did an earlier video on how to import a theme into SAP Personas. This is going to show you how to create um, a theme from scratch. So um, what, you, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to open up Personas and then you'll go to the theme gallery. Uh, this is the one we imported. If you watched the previous video, we uh, imported this Fiori inspired theme. But now we're going to uh, just create a new theme. So, in, in remember, themes apply to all transactions. So, you'll see that here after we create our theme. Um, I'm going to call this one CM for configurable management, the name of my company. And uh, we'll just call this, spell right. Management and we'll say done. And uh, this is going to pop up. The, the themes um, uh, uh, pop up is going to come up and it's going to start off on the, on the general theme and um, asking you for how you want to set certain parameters uh, for the window. And you see there's some other options here for user area, buttons, labels, etc. Uh, but we're going to start on the window. And uh, we're going to decrease the width of the window a little bit. Um, let's see, let's do uh, 90%. Um, you got to get that percent sign in there. Um, and then on the height, let's do maybe 95%. And I'm not going to bring the top down a full 10%. Let's try 7%. Um, I'm going to put my uh, company's logo in the upper left hand corner. So I'm going to uh, leave some room for that. Um, and uh, maybe we'll go slightly bigger on the height here, just stretch it out a little more. Um, so some other things I can do, um, I'm going to come down and I'm going to change the background color. I'm going to make the background color white. Now, um, and notice it, and then I kind of end up with this white on white, and we'll uh, we'll fix that here um, in, in a second. And, um, and then the other thing I'm going to do is I'm going to bring in my logo right here and we do not want it to repeat like that so we're going to come down to the background repeat we're going to say no repeat and there now I've got my logo in the upper left hand corner um, now let's make some changes um, to the actual uh, uh, user area so let's uh, we're going to do the drop down here and I'm going to select user area um, and I'm going to change that background color to be light gray. All right. Um, and you can't see it very well here um, on the S Men screen, uh, but we'll navigate to some other screens when we're done and you'll, you'll, you'll see what that did. Um, and, and I'm going to uh, keep it simple like that. I don't want to make the video too long, but you can. You can work your way through all these other options and you see you've got lots of options on, on how you want buttons to look like, labels and text, uh, you know, the, the, the uh, title bar, status bar, etc. So you got lots of options you can work through. So I'm going to go ahead and save this and we're going to close it. And let's go ahead and, um, and like I said, this will apply to all transactions, right? So if I go to create a sales order, V01. Okay, there you go. You see that that uh, that gray background that I set. So um, and uh, so if I go somewhere else, uh, let's say I'm going to create a um, I don't know, I'm going to create create a functional location. So IL01. Uh, so you see that same gray background. But my theme up here that I've created with the white background and my company's logo um, does not change. Uh, that will that will stay like that. Um, and and you saw me setting that here through Personas. Um, I can I can definitely uh, through the SAP GUI through the um, and the admin transaction uh, for Personas. I can f uh, force this theme onto uh, different uh, users. Um, and uh, so you know, so, so that um, um, they can't change change the theme, so that they're only using this theme. Um, so that's it. I just wanted to show you the the basics of getting started, and you can you can uh, play around with all the different options and and really come up with a with a theme that you like. 
or use one of the, the themes that are out there to, to download. Thank you very much.